Stevenson falls to Alvernia today at Owings Mills Gymnasium. Glenn Clark with head coach Jackie Boswell. Coach, clearly your team struggled from the floor today. Where was the line between taking bad shots versus maybe just getting bad luck, bad luck on some of the shots you took? Um, so for the last two days in practice, we talked about how good of a defensive team they were and that we were going to have to make them play defense. Um, we couldn't go one-on-one. -on -one. We had to hit the second or third option in our offense. We clearly did not do that today enough, enough times. When we did it, we you know, ran the shot clock down a few times and scored. Um, and then I thought really, you know, I, I thought we did a good job in the half court defense. The problem is when you only shoot 20% on the offensive end, you give them quick um, transition shots. So I actually didn't think, even though they had 60 points, uh, I didn't think the defense actually was that bad. I thought it was the offense that really contributed to their offense. Our bad offense contributed to theirs. Yeah, this is literally going to be the next question. Is, is there something to be said for even on a day where shots aren't falling, it's easy to get frustrated? It did seem like your players still dug in and were ready to go on the defensive end. Yeah, I mean, it's just hard when you're try you're always in transition defense. So that's, you know, transition defense is the toughest one to play. And, and uh, when you don't score, that's what you're in. And so that made it really tough for us. And then, you know, we talked about knocking down open shots. I thought we got some open shots. We didn't knock them down. So we're still a very um, streaky team, very inconsistent. Um, so I think practices have to get a little bit more consistent and um, see what happens. So I was going to ask, we're not, not going to see you again here for a little while. This is the last home game until calendar 2023. Biggest priorities for you? You got a couple more games and you go down to Florida. What are the biggest priorities for you for this team before we see you again here in January? Well, we're not tough. Um, so I think that the biggest priority is going to be to really push them a little bit harder in practice and, and make them tougher. We're, we're just not tough right now. Um, they're being pushed now in practice, and it, you know, it, it's, not, um, it's not enough, and they're not responding to it right now. And so um, we just got to push a little bit harder and see who's, who's got it and who doesn't and, and see who can come out and be the toughest one we have. All right. uh, if I could, before I wrap up, I had a members of the 2015 team here celebrating. I know it was kind of awkward during the pandemic trying to do reunions, things right. like that. Um, what does it mean to you to see those players here and obviously the things they accomplish? Uh, it's great. It's a we actually tried to plan this as an alumni day, so it was really good to see a lot of players here. I think Sam Murray's here from the 2013 class. and um, So we're pretty excited about that. We're going to have just a little reception up in the state and uh, President Suite, and you know it's good to kind of just reminisce, uh, you know, and 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 have some fun and talk about the good old days. Uh, Coach, uh, happy holidays. Uh, w wish you luck over these next couple weeks. We'll see you back here in January. All right. Great. Thank you. She's Jackie Boswell. I'm Glenn Clark. GoMustangSports.com.